Sitting at a desk all day is a necessary evil for a lot of the people in today's workforce, but unfortunately it can wreak havoc on your overall mobility levels. So we're gonna show you something you can do without leaving your chair, but still improve your mobility. So the first one's gonna be just a simple cat camel. All you're gonna do is just flex your spine forward, letting your back round, and then you're going to arch your back, pushing your chest forward. This is gonna work on overall spine mobility, which is gonna help prevent injuries in the long run. Second one you're gonna do now that you've got your spine warmed up is you're going to work on some rotations. So sit up nice and tall in your chair, think good posture, cross your arms in front of you, and you're going to turn to the right or to the left as far as you can, letting your head turn with your body. Give a little bit of an exhale with every turn and focus on trying to turn just a little bit further every single time. Next up, we have controlled articular rotations. And this one I'm showing you from two angles just so you can get a better appreciation for what we're trying to accomplish with this one. So you're trying to move your shoulder blades on your rib cage in basically a big circle. So you're going to shrug up, you're gonna pinch them together, bring them back down. And the whole time you're doing this, you're focused on creating the biggest range of motion possible, drawing the biggest circle, so to speak, with your shoulder blades. Next, you have a face pull. So for this one, stand up nice and tall, brace your stomach. Imagine like you're holding a stick with your two hands and pull it to your forehead and focus on pinching your shoulder blades together and rotating your hands backwards every time you finish that pull. Next up, we have a seated hip flexion. So think good posture on this one, brace your stomach, stay tall, and simply bring your knee to your chest as high as you can without letting your low back round. That's important on this one. Stay tall, brace your stomach, and then flex your knee up as high as you can. Next up, we have external and internal rotations. So same cues as before, stay nice and tall, keep your stomach braced. And without letting your knee shift from side to side, you're simply going to rotate your foot inward and then outward, much like a rotisserie would work. And then next up, same exact position, nice and tall, nice and braced on the stomach. You're simply going to extend your knee forward and then as you bring it back, you're going to flex your heel to your butt as hard as you can. So squeeze that chair underneath of the back of your knee and brace it hard. Same thing with the knee. So squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. We're looking for a lot of tension on this one. 